Michael, you must be left wondering how you haven't won that one tonight. Yeah, we are, of course. Uh, we did uh, everything and more to win the game. We had enough chances to win more than one game. We shot ourselves in the foot a little bit with uh, the nature of how we conceded. it. We saw a free kick to give away, and it's a fantastic... Uh, you know, Collie Woodrow has a fantastic strike. Um, but we have enough chances in the second half to win the game. Obviously, we missed the penalty. So, yeah, it was disappointing. Our goalkeeper has a fantastic night. Um, so, yeah, we're disappointed to drop the two points. You mentioned them. Their goalkeeper played superbly well. And, like you say, you had so many chances. It's just so frustrating that you couldn't get a second on the night. Well, yeah, look, they were um, they were great chances as well. You know, in the middle of the goal. And, you know, Sam on another night, Sam Surridge will go home with the match ball, let's be honest. You know, and uh, the goalkeeper makes some fabulous saves. A couple of them, I think they just hit them as well, the one at the back post. But ultimately, you know, you have to put the ball in the net and we didn't do that. So, you know, we dropped two points. Despite the frustration, like you say, of dropping two points, are there plenty of positives to take? Yeah, look, our attitude towards the game was terrific. You know, some of our play in the first half and some of our play in the second half was terrific. You know, the, diff the difficulty is in the second half of the game, the game gets stretched, we get dragged into a bit of a... You know, the the game's very open at that point in time, and you know we have a team that's just trying to play off your mistakes. They're trying to force you into mistakes and play off them. They don't really play uh, with any, you know, build the game from the back or try and hurt you that way. So, and they put, you know, they're very good at it. There's no criticism of how they play. They're very, very good at it. Um, but, but we didn't have the same level of control at times in the second half that we had in the first. What was your take on the sending off? Look, I think looking at looking at it from the technical area, I, I didn't I didn't think there was very much in it. I thought two players went for the ball. I know when you slow it down, you look at it, it doesn't look great, but the referee makes that decision. Listen, it may well have been a yellow, but I thought a red a red was a bit excessive. What was your view of the situation right towards the end of the game around the technical area? Well, you know, we looked the ball's going in. You can see that they're trying to you know stop us taking the throw in quickly. Dean's going to try and get the ball. Their, their coaching staff, the reaction is very excessive. Someone throws a punch, for, which is never great. And then uh, that causes what we get. That causes the reaction that we get and everyone gets involved. And um, So, yeah, I don't know how the referee can differentiate two red cards for our staff and only one for their staff. But, you know, I think some of his decisions at night, uh, you know, certainly need a little bit of explaining. In the second half, Joe Allen came off. Was he carrying a bit of a knock? Yeah, he got a, he got he got he got a bit of a knock towards the end. You could see he blocked a shot, I think, so it was ankle. So yeah, we had to, we had to just take him off at that minute in time. You brought Abdallah Seymour on for his debut. Mm -hmm. How do you feel as though he fared? I thought he looked lively. I thought he did. You know, he, he injected a little bit of something uh, that we needed at that point in time. Uh, you can see, I think he'll trouble defenders in this league, and uh, it was just a shame that you know he, soon after he came on. Obviously, we were down to ten men, which makes it very difficult for the striker in that situation. But as I say, um, I thought you know he showed us uh, you know considering that he's only been with us for a day and been in the building for a day, he showed a lot of positive things. And you've got a short period of time now to get ready for Derby County on Saturday. Yeah, we'll get, you know we'll have two days. It's uh, turned the team around and be ready to play Saturday, and we will be.